Hi guys! So I'm back with another DIY stackable bracelet tutorial and this time it's all about the dainty bangles. So let's start with the easy one first. Cut a piece of 20 gauge wire the same length as your wrist size minus half an inch. At one end, use needle nose pliers to create a hook. Now I'm going to use a heart charm for this, but you can use anything that has an opening at both ends for attachments. So I place my charm onto the hook and I close it up with my pliers. At the other end of the wire, I dip it into some jewelry glue and using a tiny seed bead, I attach it to the end. You don't need to do this, but it helps the wire from snagging onto your clothes. With the round nose pliers again, I create a hook and through Newton's law of equal and opposite reaction, the bangle won't get loose when you hook it onto the charm. Ta-da! Dainty! Okay, so this next one is replicated from an Etsy seller, which a link shall be posted down below. Same dealio, you'll need about 6 inches of wire. To create the letter L, I just loop it up and then downwards. I pinch it upwards and I pull the wire towards me and then I try to flatten the wire down. I bend the wire upwards into an O shape and then I loop the top from the left to the right making sure that I tuck the flattened part into the loop. Next, I bend the wire down and using my pliers, I bend it straight back up to create the letter V. I slightly bend the wire down again and this time I pull it back and I flatten it from the back. So I pull it up to the right again and I create a loop swinging up to the left and then down to create the letter E. So you're gonna want to bend and play around with it a bit just to get the letters to align and to look a little bit prettier. Now I add a few glass beads to the wire in front of the letter L. I cut off the excess wire and with pliers create a loop to close it. I add beads to the wire behind the letter E and I close it as well with my needle nose pliers. Bend the wire to the back and this will shape to your wrist and stop the beads from sliding everywhere. I finish it off by adding chains and a clasp. You can pretty much do anything else you want to it, but I like the simplicity of a chain. So that's that. A little bit of something goes a long way when you want to stack up your arm parties. So don't forget to follow me on Instagram, make requests on my Facebook, or say howdy do down below. Good luck you guys, and always remember to have fun with every project. See you later!